they're going to help you achieve your goals. You're going to be mentally in such a better position. And again, I've said this from experience where I might have clients who have a really bad week and not because anything has come about, not because they've been busy and done all X, Y, and Z, but because they've not commit. And they know they've not committed and they've admitted that. And they've told me mentally, it's been a terrible week because they know they could be doing better. Now, fast forward to the week after and they absolutely nail it and commit. What happens? I get feedback saying, Connor, my mental health has been in such a better place. Why don't I do this more? I don't know about you, but I'd rather go through life with very good mental health, knowing that I'm working hard on myself, knowing that I'm doing the things that I said I would do, committing to the things I said I would commit to, rather than being a person who is full of excuses, feels legitimately shit about themselves, and allows that to span into other parts of their life. That's not for me. And if you listen to this podcast, that's not for you. That is why you're here. That's why you've read the title and gone, 